on Oplexi I'm Oplexity and um, today I'm going to show you how to add name tags um, on your clips with Sony Vegas Pro 8 and uh, Adobe Photoshop CS4. So here's my clip, kind of uh, quickly edited and what I want to do is open Photoshop CS4, make a new file. Um, like with the size you want, a new project, I mean, with a size you want, um, then just uh, select the text tool, click, then write your name. You can select then the font you want, um, not that one. A really nice one. Where's my uh where is it? Anyway, let's take whatever okay, like example, this one. Um then you can go in effects. Oh, just select don't forget to select the text uh, layer, then go in effects then select um, gradient overlay if you want to add the gradient um, I'm just gonna do it a simple one Maybe this I'm gonna change that color to my blue and that one to a black looks pretty nice um, then I'm just gonna make another glow white with a little spread and make it on normal. Okay, so here I have my name tag. You can add whatever you what else, whatever you want on it. Um, like you can use brushes that you can download with Google. I got a lot of them. For example, just to show you. Um, oh, this one's way too big. Example. That's a brush. Looks pretty nice. So, yeah, I'm just gonna hide a brush really fast. Um, I don't want to duplicate. I want to make a new layer. Uh, layer 1. We'll put it under the text. So it goes right under it, and we'll select one, the one I want. Um, whatever, this one. Yeah, by example, if I want this one, okay, like that. And you can also add effects on it. We'll just add a gradient on it too. Um. Gradient, that the same. Yeah, that looks nice like that. Add a gradient if you want, and yeah, okay. Then remove the background, and you will see um there's a. It, uh, when you see squares like that, it means that it's transparent. Then um you will have to save it as um save as then choose PNG. Um, I'm just gonna okay, just gonna call it complexity name tag noun. Okay. Then you can close it if you want. Um, then just find where you did save it, which I don't know right now. Oh, complexity. Oh, right there. So now you have it. What you want to do is um, move it on top of everything. So just make these those track there, then move it, move those down like that, and put it on the top and make it the size of the clip. Um, just fade in, fade out. 
All right, so let's see what it does right now. So as you can see, it's added to the clip. What you want to do now is to move it around and to um, place it where you want. So just play with it. Um, you can put it uh, everywhere you want. Oh, don't forget to go in properties and uncheck maintain aspect ratio so you can move it uh, all around. And yeah, you can pretty much move it all around, resize it. I'm just gonna make it like that. Um, maybe add it in a corner. Oh, yeah, that corner. We'll place it right there. So, yeah, um, then close it. So, as you can see, it's added to the clip. And fade out, yeah. Uh, what you want, what you can do also is add a transition to it. Anyway, um, yeah, that's it. Um, you got your name tag in the corner, fade in, fade out. It follows the clip. Uh, yeah, that's it. Um, hope you enjoyed it, and I'm gonna come back with some more tutorials with Sony Vegas and Photoshop CS4 and with many 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 YouTube layouts because um, I really like to make some so yeah that's it I hope you liked it